Dalton said he's on a roll, but he's on a couch, actually. I said that I'm on a roll, but you should die in a hole. <laughs> Yeti Viami. Oh, is that Instagram during our recording? We're starting? Oh, Looks like gamers? we're throwing Aiden's phone. We would throw your phone away, but your dad already did it. We <laughs> dabbed on. Oh. Dabbing on the ground it is like dabbing on the poor. They can't help it because they don't have, like... The money to respond. Hey, if, if you're, you're ever mad, sad, just punch, punch an, an orphan. orphan. What are they going to do? Tell, tell their parents. parents. <laughs> what are they going to do? Tell the police? Oh, wait. For <laughs> no, because they're not snitches, Dalton. Can you Gosh. move the cursor off of the thingy so I can, like, see what the time is? Ah, yeah. yeah. oh, yes. Just so we know that we're, like, 40 seconds in. <laughs> well, <laughs> when it gets later, it's like, he, what time was it? He actually wasn't wrong. It's, like, 40 seconds. <laughs> wow, that's impressive, Aiden. I have gamer skills. <laughs> it's almost as... <laughs> All right. I has anyone ever? It's almost as if I can tell time. Have either of you guessed the time by looking at your shadow and like been close? I no, because unless unless time. it is literally high noon, and I know the McCree funnies, but like unless it is literally high noon, I guessed can't it do was that. three once by looking at my shadow, and it was like three o'clock. It was, was like, like nice. It was like six o'clock at night. <laughs> Like, I guess that it was three o'clock <laughs> once from looking at my shadow and my dad beat me for being useless. <laughs> okay, slow down, Anna. Just go home and rethink your life. Ooh, I performed a... Oh my, oh wow. Oh, 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 oh. What? Whoa. Nani? Um... Uh-uh, um... Do that again. I didn't know that you can clip through that. There. Can you like crouch and then like do a backflip? You can, but I need to wall. Okay, now I can't go through the thing, so I can. Yeah, there we go. You just can't make that. Yee. Yee. Remember when that was funny? No. 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 Okay. Remember when that was funny? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Wet dry world is done. Okay. Spencer, you'll think it's funny in four months when you see it on Discord server. <laughs> <laughs> the Alpha Rad Discord server. <laughs> what? Tall, tall mountain for me. The thing is, I'm the Alpha Rad, but I'm not even on his Discord server. I don't know why you're not. <laughs> I thought I was the Alpha Rad, because I own the channel that like, gets ours popular. <laughs> <laughs> well, now he's off the channel, and it's better. Do you guys want to see a gamer secret? Does the one up? Oh, can you get on the slide on this Can I, guys? It's windy from Mario. Oh, yeah, answer my question. I, I can we, get on the slide. We prefer not to answer your questions. It usually leads to pain and suffering. Spencer. I Moving on. Is that a mushroom? Whoa. A star on it? Yeah. Peak commentary. It's it's the lonely mushroom. It's literally called the lonely mushroom. I am the lonely Goomba. <laughs> Remember when that channel was good? What channel? Remember when it was a channel? Is this still post? Do you guys remember the guy Jing Goomba? <laughs> <laughs> I actually he still like watch live streamed his marriage. <laughs> I actually was I'm gonna still do watch that. it. <laughs> remember the guy in Game Theory who committed suicide? Me <laughs> neither. <laughs> yep. That's not a funny thing to really joke about. And you really shouldn't. I wasn't joking. I don't remember him. <laughs> Ronnie Ani Edwards. Ronnie, remember when Game like Theory Donnie? got <laughs> You really shouldn't joke about it. <laughs> I really that. shouldn't, but I did. Remember I'm Game Theory got robbed for like now. millions of dollars? Good times. If he hadn't given Undertale to the Pope. What he gets? <laughs> that was what the Pope guy. <laughs> Matt Pat, if you give Undertale to the Pope, I'm literally gonna kill myself. That's <laughs> what <laughs> <laughs> this guy said. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so, so sorry. <laughs> stop. We're all going to hell. <laughs> Say you have my ticket, good, alright. <laughs> Off to a great uh, start. What? I was gonna say something. This monster is dying. <laughs> Freaking demonetization is so stupid now. Like This is like oh, yeah, you can audio errors to based on, uh, suicide jokes. You, you can now be uh, demonetized from what people say in your uh, comment section. People don't comment on our videos anyway, so it doesn't matter. But like, <laughs> literally that means that someone else can spite another person. People can spite others now on YouTube. I'm gonna and like save the N word. <laughs> refuse, whoa, whoa. refuse YouTube. People you can save there. the N word. That's racist. Don't take my hat. All right. You, other people can literally refuse others to get paid, and I'm like, I, 
if you're going to implement the system, at least make it so that we can, like, ban certain words from being in our comments. Guys, let's all something. ban the N-word on Matt Pass channel. <laughs> just or dig not. them deeper into the hole. Or you really shouldn't, Aiden. <laughs> if I can see the lonely mushroom, I can jump to it. Ooh. Not, Aiden. That's like me, like after you get money for something and then me taking it from you. And Just like taxes. <laughs> yeah, except, <laughs> except you don't get to get any of that back ever. I hate when people Aiden. say like tax returns are like free money. It's like you it's you made the money anyway, and the government took it from you, and now they're giving it back because well you know. <laughs> They decided like, they we're already in debt. We're just gonna uh, yeah, go. They didn't need sure. all of your money. They just needed most of it. They just needed all of your money. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love hearing monkeys. That's you would love uh, Detroit. Oh, this is a very offensive episode. <laughs> oh, um, <laughs> did you see that? Uh, yeah, Modder put uh, <laughs> in audit. Someone made the frick. What is? Dragon Roost Island in uh, Odyssey. What? Someone made a uh, Dragon Roost Island in Super Mario Odyssey, and it's actually really cool. How do you get that star? That one? You get the one in the cave. Because <clears throat> there was a block that said, hey, you know what I'm going to get is the star that uh, apparently I can't look at, but it's down there somewhere. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, uh, oh, you can kind of see it. Yeah, okay, see that mushroom? I have to jump to that, and I have no idea... Long jump off that side. Right my camera it. literally cannot look in that direction because my cameraman is, like, really bad. Oh, so we're over there, so... It's, like, off that little peak there. Yeah, but, like, I can't... I can't see Just the go direction. Straight. I can't go straight because the camera keeps changing. You can go sideways. So it's... All the same. should be good from there. But if I zoom out, it, like, literally shifts it. Right, you go. Wrong way. I can't see! <laughs> Alright, well... Like I said, if the camera allowed you to move it more than like two directions... Can I talk about Trump Man yet? Are those painting? I wonder, are those paintings just like 2D images? It had the ripple just, effect, yeah. And there's whoa, just, whoa, and there's whoa, just whoa, a... Whoa, whoa, and there's whoa. just a hole behind them? Is that how they do it? You can. There's some guy who does like the boundary break series. Jeez. I don't know. Oh, they don't have the owl on this one. They had the owl on the um. And yeah, but I know who you're talking about. You know, I like to tell a gamer story. Go ahead. Like, all right, thank you. Can you just so, talk to all right, no. I'm at Pumpkin Show, which is a thing that we have in Circle Whale. It's great. It's like a festival about pumpkins. It's. It's, it gets worse every year, uh, but at the same I time, like it gets it, better every year. Because I decide not to be a pessimist about life. So I guess, but, okay. Or anyway, you just are you're just a realist. optimistic and say <laughs> things for the sake of not being negative. Anyway, so it's <laughs> due into the year 2016. Well, uh, the election for the presidential candidates was happening. Oh, yeah, Aiden as we speak. wearing a Trump flag. Thank you, wearing Spencer. Wearing the flag. You have to yeah. let me explain the story first. So... We're over there walking by the Republican booth, and I see this Trump flag for like ten dollars, and I say, "Can I have that flag?" And they say, "Yeah." And then I buy the flag. <laughs> I know, very climactic. I buy the flag. I buy a sign. I buy a hat, and then I buy a pin. And me and Hayden Bear run around Pumpkin Show as Trump Man, and until eventually we go to the Republican headquarters in Circleville, and they like give us pizza and stuff for supporting the cause or something. It is great, because we, like, got yelled at and stuff by people who... Oh, wait, who yelled at you? I was, uh, like, a bunch of fat libtards. Anyway. I, I was like, Ben Shapiro was probably gonna get, like... Ben Shapiro was okay, it. It, it, No, it was great. Like, 2016 was the best year for the pumpkin show. Oh, Whoa. I did it! Oh. You know, you wow, I actually got that on my second try. We and then it just we suddenly went downhill. U.S. Oh, history, yeah. and we were talking about... Um, U.S. history? No, we were... T oh, yes, idiot. <laughs> we were no. talking well, yes. about um, no, but the actually, yes. Immigration Act of 1917, which is really fun. No. But anyway, uh, of course, apparently there's literally there's a like white supremacist like Nazi like group. Whoa, that's crazy. And like, they call the KKK. Show us, like, one of, no, Miss McGinnis <laughs> showed us one of their posters. 
and she's like, what is this, like, do you guys agree with this poster? And we're all like, yeah, like, looks fine. And, like, we went to their website, and it looked, like, super cultish and stuff. What? And like, yeah. And you know how it's, like, life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness? Mm-hmm. It was life, liberty, and truth on their website. And, like, all their pictures are, like, them wearing, like, American, like, masks and stuff. Like, I'm like, mm -hmm. It, it Where's the story going? <laughs> it was found in Circleville, in like downtown Circleville. There was a poster found like for recruitment. I'm like, this makes me feel not safe. You don't live in Circleville. I but everything, <laughs> everything my family does takes place in Circleville, bud. That's sad. mostly. Except I'm gonna be the one person in my family, family that's actually gonna move out of Circleville. Dude, pick away in Ross Counties or Black Holes. You can't move out. You just gotta move out of Ohio. You have to get out. Because Ohio's great. Divide by zero again. How is it great? There's some certain things about Ohio that's great. Like, we so got some nothing? certain things we like... We got Six Flags. We got King <laughs> Island. Oh, yeah, Six Flags. Oh, our uh, zoo is actually the best in the country, so... I can go visit those if I live in another state. It's not like I'm barred from doing that <laughs> if I don't live here. You legally cannot. The question is what's good about like living you know. here, not visiting here. You can do right Nothing coins. really wrong with living here. So, because it's not absolutely terrible, it's great, <laughs> is what you're saying. Well, it's when not you could live bad. anywhere else, like, I'd love to live in New York City. Like, mm, so many more. Probably, okay, that's more probably experience worse than than my wallet here. would not love to live in New York well, City. Well, okay, so think about it. If you had money to do that. And I'm 90% sure that's worse than, like, living in Ohio. I'm 100% oh, sure secret. that it's not. Because you actually have stuff to do, you can get opportunities, and tons what of the, other stuff that you the, cannot do in Circle of Ohio. The, but there's a lot of right things that you can do in Circleville, Ohio that you can't what? do. In what? What can you do in Circleville, Ohio? Uh, well, you can do drugs. <laughs> That's you it. We did black it. tar heroin. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we won't have a movie theater anymore. We don't. We don't have anything in Circleville. Correct me if I'm wrong. So you cannot correct me because I'm not wrong. We literally have the pumpkin what the show freak? That you're ah! talking about. Oh yes, the pumpkin show once a year. You are correct. I was gonna say I can that. Visit is the that. reason to stay in Circleville. No, it's pretty good. Alright, we're gonna it. abandon Tall Tall Mountain and talk to this guy. Hello! I'm Toad! Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the hardest star in the game to get because you have That's to like. That's what you said last time. Because it's, it's funny. Whoa! Whoa! Joel, so remember it that, is Joel. the hardest star in the game to get because I missed it like four times. <laughs> Do you want to save? I'm gonna uh, do this. Alright, ready? Ready? <laughs> oh man, it's like the 16th time we've done this on the channel. Yahoo! Whoa. Do it Let's the, just open the <laughs> door. The wow, there we go! Take my. Yeah, I don't have enough. I want to see how much speed I can realistically get. Um, Where's the endless circus? Up here. I wonder when this, uh, when the endless one was discovered. Um, 2000. The glitch? Yeah, because I was, like, watching a video and, like... It's really easy to do. Oh, crap, I have a story that I want to tell. Okay, wait, are you trapped up there? No. No. So the way that this entire Whoa. staircase, well, okay, hold it on. teleports you. Yeah, really? that's why it's that's how it's endless. Yes, it keeps teleporting wow. you down seamlessly. Anyway, so I ta I'm taking physics right now, um, and we're discussing like waves and like mediums and stuff. So our science well, teacher's like, "Hey, you're taking guys. the physics half of physical science." That's not. Thank hard. you. That was a physics good itself. That was a good contribution to my no, story. You're right. Physics itself is a much different. thing. I was being sarcastic. I'm trying to tell a story. Anyway, so we're working on medians right now, yeah. and um, she's like, "All right, guys. So a little thing I have to tell you about this. Have y'all ever heard of Ouija boards?" And we're like, "Whoa, yeah, Miss Gazel." Crazy. Like, well, and then goes on this like ten minute tirade of why you shouldn't do them, citing stuff from the Bible. Why you should? It was great, and I was like, Gossel, I kind of want to take my notes, but this is also nice too. I mean, so we go in. Okay, so that happens. We go in the the next day, 
And so she's teaching this to like three different classes right now. And she's like, have I told you this guy's, you, yeah, have I told you guys this yet? And I mean, we're like, cause people do them and like, why? And we're like, like no, good no, Miss Gossel. People do We haven't like heard that from you before. And she's like, okay. And then tells us the same thing, but with even more stuff this time. So it takes up 20 minutes of class time. We almost got it three days in a row and it was great. And then I one class period. I don't period. get where all these stories come from because she's great with our class. Okay. Our class loves her. Well, maybe your class is dumb <laughs> and also stupid. Maybe <laughs> our class just listens to our teachers and we have about, their about Ouija boards. Okay. Is... And then we're like Literally taking all notes of the on the teachers like, love our class. We're, we're taking notes on seismic waves, and uh, waves are a bit oh, difficult. She's like. Hey, you guys want to hear my opinions on people's relationships? And we're like, what? And so she just talks about that and never flips to the next out slide, even though that was like the other part of the chart that we had to write down for notes. I don't get why everyone has an issue with her except for our class. Oh, you so know. So does we, your class. <laughs> you know what I should talk about yeah, as a teacher really that I had at New Hope called Mr. Dieter. Well, this this is a technology guy that you with. No. Um, he was, um, well, he taught my science classes, and he was, uh, strange. So, basically what Mr. Dieter did, the first day of class, we had a quiz over his family. I'm not kidding you. <laughs> really? That's worse than Miss Gossel. <laughs> like, significantly worse. Miss Gossel actually did something sensible. She gave us a... I'm not done with my story, Spencer! Yeah, well, he I keeps interrupting. <laughs> this is why we can't do story time with Spencer. It just doesn't work. Alright, fine. Finish your story, then okay. I'll, like, say what I was gonna say. Um, so basically, Mr. D... Nice save. Mr. Dieter had a system of currency called Dieter Dollars, where he... <laughs> he, he gave... It... Oh. He gave you, uh, Dieter Dollars for doing, like, anything, basically. Um... Mr. <laughs> Mr. D gave us Dieter Dollars for doing something. Well, he, it was like, you That's got him literally for anything. Big, but okay. It was ma mostly winning games, but like, if you knew the material, you get Dieter Dollars, which you could spend on extra credit, which you oh, didn't really like need if you already nice. knew the material. So, I sa- Okay. I'll take an extra. I, I saved, it was literally 5% on a quiz or test per dollar, so it was like, yeah. That's busted, So actually. literally what I did is I saved all of them, because I got good grades in that class anyway. Oh, check this out. Zawa water do. But I saved up all of my Dieter dollars, and um, literally spent them all on the last exam and got a 210% <laughs> on the good. final. Yeah. So I ended up getting like a, literally 120 in the what, class. What grade were you in? Sixth. You had wait, wait, final wait. exams in sixth Hold grade? Up. It was just the last test. Oh, okay. Like Hold up, so, like, did you answer any of the questions, or did you just turn it in blank? <laughs> well, I answered all the questions, because I wanted to see how high I could get, but I already knew all of them, so it was like... <laughs> I literally got a 210% like so. on the test. And yeah, they did have a function of dollars, and I think that was in my 8th grade year, and that was the last year that they did it. I don't even remember what we spent them on. Good story. <laughs> but, like, I, no, I'm just saying it's related. But anyway, You weren't even saying, saying that it was related. What I was saying about Miss Gossel, what she did on the first day, she gave us an end of the year quiz from uh, New York, for New York standards. On and the first day. On the first day, first just day to see how much we knew Gossel about biology. And it honestly, to me, like, not a lot of it was too difficult. I think I got like an 88 huh. on it, which was like the highest in the class. And like, from that, point on, she's always been, like, super impressed with my ability in biology. She's like, you should be a pathologist. And I'm like, well, look at Mr. Intelligent Trousers <laughs> over here. Alright, well, that's gonna be the episode, guys. Thanks for watching. This is a bonus episode, remember. Be sure to hit that red rectangle on the vertical thumb. Well, I get another star. Or if you're in Australia, hit the one that's, like... No, don't dislike it if you're in Australia. <laughs> ah, wait, I'm getting another star! No! You're gonna get another star. I'm not stopping. There you go.